Hi viewers, welcome back. You can see this one is the our excavator, valve excavator EC480B. Uh, this excavator have the problem of swing. All functions are okay, only just uh, swing is not working. I electrically check it. Okay, here are its uh, solenoids. You can see here are the solenoids. I check the solenoids have the power. Now I came to know there is a not any solenoid involved in the swing function. These solenoids are of, for other functions. So now I am going to diagnose it by the hydraulic point of view. I check the hydraulic motor directly. So as you can see I have we have the removed the hydraulic hose. Okay. So we are going to remove this. Uh, there are the two swing motors. One and two. So first we remove this one. This one will be dismantle and check maybe inside have a problem. And if there is not problem after we remove this second one. Okay. So these both we will remove and check inside. Maybe someone is broken. Therefore this swing has blocked. So electrically it was no problem. But these two swing motor we will remove and check inside. So we have removed the hose. So now we will uh, uh, remove these uh, uh, motors. So we, as you can see we have removed uh, one motor and now we are going to dismantle it and check inside whether is it damaged inside or not. If this motor is a good one is not faulty then we remove the second one. So here we have uh, dismantled the this motor and uh, this is a motor and, and this one is our uh, planetary. You can see the all the uh, gears are good one. This is a motor is not damaged inside. So our one motor is a good one. So now we are going to uh, second motor. Okay. So we will check uh, second motor have a problem. If both motors are a good one, then we check and other issues. Hi viewers. Here you can see on the right side we remove the motor with planetary, but right left side only remove the motor so right side uh, right side motor is a good one that is no problem but this left side uh, planter is here but we have removed the motor and that motor is jammed so there was the problem motor was jammed i also show you this is also that motor is also broken so I so viewers let's go down uh, downside so i will show you the condition of this uh, second motors i am sorry i am not showing you the process of uh, this uh, removing the motors because in this way our videos become too much long and you people don't like the long videos so therefore for saving your times i not showing to the recording of the this uh, removing the motors We also you can see these are the two motors. This one is the first one which was on the right side. This was a good one. And this is a second motor which on the left side I already showed you. And this motor is jammed inside. And here you can see this area is broken. Okay, this motor was jammed. And we, this area is broken. So this motor is a jammed. No good one. So we also now we further going to dismantle this motor and uh, we check inside why this motor is jammed what happened to inside the gears and uh, why this motor is jammed so i not uh, i'm not going to show you this mantling process because in this our video become too much long after dismantling i will i am going to hold a video here and after dismantling show you its condition so as you can see we have a dismantled this motor okay so other part is here we have dismantled and uh, you can see we have the this area is a finish okay we have this uh, piston of this motor nut bolt and you can see what is the this bearing has finish this plate also finish okay these are the disc brake so you can see this motor is jammed so so viewers hope you understand why the machine was not doing the swing functions because you see 
in the condition in the front of you hope you like this video please don't forget to subscribe my channel and share this video to your friends